Hello everyone, welcome to Johnny's Nasdaq YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to install Microsoft Office desktop version on your computer. You might be wondering why we need that Microsoft already providing free online web Office product for us to use. Well, there are lots of benefits to use full versions of Office 365 on your desktop. I have a blog post regarding this video and also listed the difference missing features between online version and desktop version. First of all, you need to use it online. If you are offline, you cannot see that anymore. Also, you need to upload your Office document to your OneDrive. You cannot directly use it on your local disk. There are other advanced features also missing for each version. You'll find it from here. To install Office 365 to your computer could be very simple and easy to do. You just need to log into your Office and you will see this Install Office button. If you have subscription or you paid one-time fee for your Office, it usually costs you about $250 for your home version or business version, one user. You can directly install your Office from your account from the apps and devices. You may not have a subscription, then you won't find this button. If you don't have subscription, you don't have license, you won't be able to see this button. As I can show you from this page, there's only view apps and devices. As mentioned, there's a lot of ways and you can get free Microsoft 365 E5 license or business license, basic one, which I showed you in my previous labs here. Check them out if you don't have license, else you are going to have to purchase from Microsoft. In this video, I'm going to show you a third party tool, completely free, but also it's legit. Office Tool Plus. This is the website and lots of key features here. You can use it fast and easy to deploy your office and help you to activate your license. Again, it's a safe, it's a legit software. It's just use Microsoft Office deployment tools and OSPP tool component to help you to install your office and activate it, manage license, etc., etc to make things much easier to do, much effective as well. So now let's start it. As mentioned, this tool is free and I can make the installation of this much faster and easier. How easier it could be? Two steps. So I already listed the all related content information in my blog post. You should be able to get it from the section Office Tool Plus. For example, this is a home page Office Tool to Plus. Go to the home page and go to the project page, which you will directly see the download button. From the download button, you can see that there's a normal zip archive, include the runtime. We need this runtime zip archive. So let's download it from GitHub. Open file. This Office tool, let's move it to your desktop. To 
completed, double click Office Tool this folder, you will see Office Tool plus this exe file. Double click to run it. You will get this Windows Protect Your PC warning. Click More Info. Yes. Again, as a message, you will need to accept the software license terms and Microsoft Service Agreement. Click Yes on that. Okay, this modern nice UI shows up. You can see there's an Install Office button. There's a couple options already predefined here. You can install Microsoft 365 apps, 365 Family, Personal, LTSC Professional Plus, Office Home and Student. Usually for a company, you probably already have this Office Professional Plus 2021 volume license. If so, I'm going to use in this as an example to show you the process how to install it. Since this Office LTSC Professional Plus 2021 has one thing missing there, which is Visual Pro version, I need it. So you also can deploy it at the same time by adding a product with the one you want. So for example, I need Visual Professional 2021 volume license, Visual LTSC Professional 2021. If you need something else, you can add it again. So for the Office LTSC Professional Plus version, which already include access Excel, OneNote, OneDrive, Outlook, PowerPoint, Word, you may still want another thing which is very popular in the business side is project. You can add it here as well. Just click add product. Project Professional 2021. So to make things easier, I'm not adding that one right now. I'm just adding those two. After that, you don't need to make any selection. Just keep one thing. So for the activation, you can choose automatically accept the ULA or if you have MAK key, just put in here. That will activate your product very easily. But if you are having KMS in your company environment, what you're going to do here, I'm going to show you the process to put the KMS in for this Office deployment. We will get those two products installed first. Let's do start deploy. Again, here is architecture. You may want to change it to 64-bit. Let's start deploy. There's a lot of more options there. We won't go through them. We just go through those most important part, how to deploy, how to activate it. Right now we are installing Office LTSC Professional Plus and Visual LDSC Professional 2021. Click Yes. The Office Deployment Tool, which is Microsoft Original Tool, going to be launched. The Office Tool Plus. What they do is just generate an XML code file and pass it to Office Deployment Tool to install it. So again, this software is completely valid, legit, and free to use. So it will take uh, maybe 20 minutes to get everything downloaded, depending on how many components you selected. I will pause the video here. I will come back to continue once it's done. About 15 minutes waiting, 
um, my Microsoft Office has been installed successfully as you can see from the window we also can check the Word, Excel, Visual or those components the one thing you will notice is not activated yet so when you click account you will see this activation required so it's need to activate it if you have product key you can either change it here or you really need to configure your KMS if you have company or your license KMS server configured in your environment the best way you can do Using Office Tool Plus to deploy Office is completely legit way, but the way how you activate the Office is going to decide if your Office is legit. Office Tool Plus can be used wrong to activate Office if you haven't purchased license from Microsoft. To make this video to comply with community guideline, I removed the part to demonstrate how to activate Office using this free tool. Please find out other sources regarding activating Office. Thank you.